Good morning, gamers. Cyberbullying is wrong, and I don't think it's a good way to spend your time. But Command has authorized the use of a new aircraft, and cyberbullying is its primary weapon. We'll come back to that. The EF-24G is an aircraft that lives by three simple words. Give me fatter, fatter. Nothing this aircraft does is rational. Its wings can go limp, its belly carries drones, and adding weight somehow makes it go faster. Alright, 69,000 feet, gents. Now we drop the tanks. Drop. The tanks are gone. Here we go. Come on, baby. Let's get that nose fully down. And the burners fully on. No spinsies, no spinsies. How are we even getting stall warnings right now? Pointing straight down. There we go. Mach 1.4, 1.5. 1.6. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. 1.8. Come on. Come on. Come on. We need Mach 2. Come on. It's an aircraft so absurd, the developer had to program the entire electromagnetic spectrum into the game. Now, there's an important distinction here. Electromagnetic warfare is the use of the EM spectrum to attack or degrade the enemy. Microwaving a spoon is technically electromagnetic warfare. Cyber warfare is leaking the group chat, catfishing your dad, or purchasing a cameo from one of your friend's favorite actors that specifically addresses some of his deepest insecurities. Hello there, it's Mazora, your favorite she-devil. How the hells are you all, darlings? Now, listen, I am Gavin's handler. Very unfortunate for me. And I have come here, well, firstly, to give you all an apology for his absolutely cringe-worthy content on the internet. Spicy Gavino. Blech. Awful, awful name, Gavin. Really could do better. Now, as per your contract, for all this cringe-worthy content that you've been posting on YouTube and the internet, you are now obligated to eject from your aircraft. You better listen to your handler, or there'll be hells to pay. Take care, everyone, and I'm sorry again for Gavin. Ta-ta. Gavin, please go. A quick thank you to the literal Spice Barons, Russell935, Dact78, and the narrator for keeping my family alive this winter. Everyone else, please subscribe. In this aircraft, the only flight control surface the electronic warfare officer can use is the ejection seat. That one's IR, coming from the right, off the nose, off the nose. But I cannot see, I'm legally blind. Oh. I was looking back right there. And you better hope they never do, because it's borderline impossible to employ all of its weapons without them. I'm not going to give a comprehensive tutorial on how to shoot electrons, mostly because I have no idea how to, but here's the gist. The transmit screen lets you control the frequency and intensity that you cook a target with. Choose a target, make sure you're in EW, and pull the trigger. This is what happens on the other end of that beam. This has no material effect on the target, but jams their electronics, and in a couple decades, they'll be diagnosed with a rare cancer. If you think that's cruel and unusual, consider the fact that you're the one that pulled the trigger, and you're also sitting right on top of the transmitter. The Fraz page gives you a visual readout of what frequencies all known targets are emitting on. Something something, I don't know, write in a joke about 5G before uploading. The drone page violates Asimov's first law of robotics, and scares the hell out of me. For that reason, I never touch it. 
How does all of this work practically? Observe. And transmit. Okay, I'm cooking one guy. Nice. So if you have the uh, FRAZ page up, yep. uh -huh. um, you can see what uh, band each person's on. So they'll be either high, medium, or low. I think the early warnings are often low band. Yeah, he's on low band. So you want me to switch bands on him? Yeah, if you're to throw it at him, then go ahead and do that one on uh, low. I'm going to fire both and then switch to cooking them. Okay, yep. Jubity, what can I fire right now? Uh... I don't know. Try hitting the arm again just to see if you can steal it. Shoot. Oh, now I can. Then yeah, switching back to EW and switch transmitter. Cooking him as well. Okay, mod, transmit power. All right, they're both getting cooked in the medium range. So I can see our missiles. I can see that they're both getting cooked. Cool. Let's see if I correctly executed that flow. Oh, yeah, they're going for the... <laughs> They're going from the top rope, yeah. baby. <laughs> the grand slam, the people's <laughs> elbow. Let's see it. And... Oh, I think it's two hits. Kind of looks like neither of those hit. Kind of looks like both oh, of those were fine, right? Oh, I didn't see him get intercepted, though. I know. They just kind of... They just missed? They just missed. I guess I'll just try again. My Twitch chat would later tell me that apparently signal emitting decoy trucks have been added to the game. Is this true? I have no idea. As I said, VTOL has been completely overhauled in this update. And also, my Twitch chat has a habit of intentionally making the game harder for me. Uh, but yeah, we're out of uh, Winchester on those 188s, so we're gonna on home. Carrier Echo 11 request landing. Copy. Fly heading 244. Four. Expect runway 23. I didn't even notice this whole time. You've just got us going Mach 1 <laughs> to get back to the carrier. I'm on the deck and mill. It's just Mach 1. Yeah. It's, it's just like so quietly, comfortably going Mach 1. Like, what? Well, I guess that's why. <laughs> oh. I wouldn't know what to do with Okay, uh, bust the canopy. Oh my god. <laughs> that one sucks. <laughs> I, it just took my arm with it. I was holding on to the canopy. <laughs> Right, the loudest landing possible. Here we go. I got you slightly left, slightly high. Uh, unfortunately, if you're talking to me, I cannot hear you in the slightest. <laughs> right, no, that makes sense. <laughs> Max throttle! Max throttle! <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Okay, you can take off max throttle. You can land it! <laughs> No, good wave off, good wave off, good wave off. I don't off. think so. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Fuel config. You're good. Oh, oh no, we're dumping fuel. You're gonna have to make it on this pass. We don't have that much fuel. <laughs> oh, no. You've got this. Oh, idle the throttle, idle the throttle, full idle, full idle. <laughs> you can make it. Put it down. <laughs> oh, that was a bolt. Bingo fuel. 15 seconds. Here you go. Here you go. You're looking good. You're looking good. Just keep that nose down. Oh my god, your money. Alright, there's the gas. <laughs> yeah! Max the throttle! Max the throttle! There's a lot going on in this aircraft, and I'm going to need to fly it a lot more before I can explain how any of it works. If you'd like to join me in doing so, join me on stream three days a week. Thank you to those on screen, the Coriander Connoisseurs, and the Pepper Peddlers of the Spice Market. This is not a VTOL channel.